Okay, question number 14. What's the standard form question? And there's a couple of ways of doing it. One way is just to use the standard form part in the calculator. So if we check out calculator cam, and we just set this up. If we just set up um, 9.5 times, oh, well, I can just do that one. That button at the bottom is allows you to do the standard form easily to the power of 9 divided by 3.8 10 to the 3 and then hit equals so my calculator gives me what is that 1 2 3 4 5 5 so 2 million 500 thousand so if you get that you're going to obviously get one mark the final mark is it says gives you answering standard form so it clearly says there so 2.5 times 10 to the power of, well, how many times we've got to move this number? 2.5, well, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so to the power of 6. Now, there's another way you can do it, though. So, there is an alternative way. So, if we just get this out of the way, and then I just go, just using the red pen. If you do 9.5 divided by 3.8, just the number bit of the standard form, that gives you 2.5. Then if you do the powers, 10 to the 9 divided by 10 to the 3, that gives you 10 to the 6, and then you can put it back together. Sometimes you'll find that this number here will need, will need to be moved between... Um, oh, between 1 and 10. So you might have to multiply, change this number, divide, multiply, divide it by 10, or 100, or 1,000, and then you have to change this one accordingly. In this case, it works out fine, so you can just put it straight into standard form. Sometimes you don't get this number between 1 and 10 inclusive of 1.